What would you do if you were the opposite sex for a day? That's the easiest part. Mm. What's your grossest habit? Do I really want to share this? My grossest habit is... I love tomato ketchup so much that I can literally just eat it on a spoon. I guess that's pretty gross. Ketchup on a spoon, yeah. Yeah, that works. I guess that's pretty gross. <laughs> Show us one weird trick you can do with your body. Oh my god. Um, so I actually have a pretty large weenus, they call this. Oh my gosh. Does that, does that look That's pretty, than yeah. Okay. I mean, I don't know how you found that out there. Yeah, you don't want to know. <laughs> What would you do if you were the opposite sex for a day? Oh my gosh. I guess... I would just like to be inside a guy's mind. Just really see what he's thinking all the time. I don't know if I'd want to do anything. I just really want to see and like walk around and just see what goes, what the thoughts go through your head. A lot That's, going on up here. Yeah, there's a lot going on or, or not so much. I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. What was the worst pickup line that someone used on you? I think I'd rather hear yours, frankly. No, well, I had this one from, actually it was from a homeless guy on the street, which I thought was really sweet. I got out of the car and he, he ran up to me down the street. He was like, wait, wait, you forgot something. You forgot something. You dropped it. And he was like, I was like, what? And he goes, my number. I thought that was a good one. I think it's a common one, but it was no, sweet. That's pretty good. That's yeah. sweet. No oh way. Imitate your favorite celebrity. Who's my favorite celebrity? Do you do any impressions? No. Can you? I do a couple impressions. But... Come on, you're going. What's the deal with Jenga? Why are we playing this game? Do you know who that was? I actually don't. Oh, but, but maybe if you tell me. That's, that was a bad impression of Jerry Seinfeld. Oh, I actually thought it was going to be you Seinfeld. You thought it was Seinfeld? Seinfeld? <laughs> Try to juggle. Do you have anything to juggle? Two. Yeah, Ooh. Oh, oh, one-handed juggle. <laughs> Not bad. Um, okay. I think what's more impressive here is the Jenga tower. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to be able to get many more. Ah. Oh, wow. Who's on your celebrity cheating list? Oh, well, always has been, always will be David Beckham. Completely in love with him, especially being a Brit, I think. Yeah, he's always been my crush. And I'm not always into tattoos, but his tattoos are like, they're amazing. Best <laughs> diet you've ever done. It's funny, I was just talking about this. The pizza diet, where for one week, I could eat only oh, wow. pizza. So it was pizza for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and it was pretty rough. I didn't eat pizza for a long time after that, but I'm back on, yeah. I'm back on it. So. I mean, you can't lose out no. on pizza. Okay, this is crazy. Um, talk in an accent for the next three sentences. Oh. Get all the impression ones. I'm getting all the impression ones. Um, well, can you do like an American accent? Can you do like an American accent? I think it's pretty good. I need a bit of practice though. That was solid. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. We did pretty damn good though. Uh, yeah. What was it? It was tell us about the worst date you've been on. <laughs> and Megan, thanks so much for doing Thank this. Thank you so much. Fun. Thank you, it was fun. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>